Hey YouTube, Opinionated Reviewer here, and in this video I'm going to show you guys how you can get iOS 5.0 Beta 2 without a dev account. Now you're going to need a couple things, you're going to need iTunes 10.5 Beta 2 install, either you'll just keep getting iTunes 21 error, you're going to need iRev so you can avoid the 1600 errors, and you're going to need that custom, uh, that I, the iOS 5 IPSW the firmware I'm gonna have all the links in the description down below where you can get these don't worry about it so as you can see I have my iPhone 4 here it's already off in DFU mode because I'm gonna use iRep to put it in a pwned DFU state so we're gonna run iRep so I'm gonna click uh, I have an iPhone 4 so I just select the iPhone 4 and you gotta put your iDevice into DFU mode. Mine is already in DFU mode. If you don't know how to do that, you hold the power button for three seconds, then hold the power and the home button for 10 seconds, then release the power button. Keep on holding the home button for about 15 seconds or until uh, iRep recognize your iDevice. So we're gonna click OK. Just wait for that to clean up. X that off and open up iTunes 10.5 beta 2 and recognize our iDevice in a recovery mode so now you're gonna click shift restore and you're gonna look for that the cut the IPSW or the firmware for iOS beta 2 not, not beta 1 so as you can see right here we got beta this is beta 2 the one that has 8d at the end this is the first one so we're gonna click that one and we're going to restore to it I'm going to let iTunes work it, its magic then I'm going to come back when it's finished so iTunes is finished now and you can see that I don't have my UDID activated but we're going to get around that so we have we're going to just slide just set it up as, as you normally would um, join your wireless network then you're gonna get to the screen where you have to it's trying to activate your UDID so what you're gonna do is you're gonna triple tap the home button just like normal so you can so you can um, activate voice over and after you do it you're gonna triple tap it again and turn it off then you're gonna press the home button once and you're gonna see these these three options emergency call start over and cancel and I've already heard people bitching about using the emergency call um, option it doesn't you don't you don't even have any signal so it doesn't even matter plus you you don't have to make any call with this so now we're gonna just go we're gonna click emergency call it's gonna take you to this screen and what you're gonna do is power try to power it off hold down the home button till this comes up as you see that comes up when that comes up just click cancel and then you're gonna click the home button and bingo you've just got in without registering your UDID as you can see 5.0 beta but yeah bear in mind please bear in mind that this updates your baseband um, the features are not activated I'm still working on that you can still easily downgrade so don't even sweat it you can still downgrade to 4.3.3 because that's still the official uh, firmware and that's pretty much it I'm gonna make a video on snow breeze and red snow and how to jailbreak uh, iOS 5.0 beta 2 so don't worry about it and if you want to preserve your old baseband uh, Snow Breeze is the best option because it preserves your baseband the GB sim does not work with the new baseband 04.11.06 so yeah stay tuned for those videos with that being said please rate comment subscribe have a nice day Stay late.